All right, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Seven Deadly Sins Grand Cross video. So first things first, happy 100 days to all my fellow global players out there. Honestly, it doesn't feel like the game's been out for that long. You know, like I could have sworn it came out sometime early last month, maybe a little bit before that, but it's been actually over three months. And I think this is really a testament to just how much fun I've been having with this game recently because the time is just flying by. Anyways, in today's video, we are going to be summoning on the brand new 100 day special celebration banner. And I think a lot of people, myself included, were really hoping that the new character for this celebration would be Blue Lilia, right? But instead we got Green Deanne, which obviously is not as good, but at the same time, it is a DN, and I've always said on this channel that, I mean, since the first video actually, that DN is undoubtedly the best girl in the entire Seven Deadly Sins franchise. I mean, some people say Merlin, some people say Jericho, some people say Elaine, maybe if you're into that, but for me, man, DN is definitely number one, and it's not even close. So, what I'm trying to say is basically, if a new Deanne comes out, regardless of how good she is, I have to summon, man. Like, I feel obligated to summon. I mean, look, we got a Deanne right there in the layout, and my guild is called the Canadians, so it has to be done, man. We got to do it. Anyways, this is the banner. It's actually kind of interesting because there's only seven featured SSRs. I have all of them except for the new Deanne, so everybody else is basically a dupe. But that being said, I could use dupes for basically all these characters, right? Like Escanor for sure, 0.4% is actually very high for a non-main featured SSR. And uh, obviously Green King, I just got my first copy, so a couple dupes would be nice. Um, same thing with Melee, same thing with uh, Red Merlin, so definitely a lot of stuff I could use on this banner. Um, I don't think I'm going to go too deep though, because there's not a lot of new stuff, not a lot of like super exciting stuff I could pull, so... Anyways, that is the plan. Let's jump into it, guys. Oh, you know what? Real quick, let's actually do our ticket first. The free ticket for today. I've actually been having some pretty good luck on this banner. Like, I had, I think, two multis where I pulled double SSRs. And considering it's free tickets, that's a pretty good deal right there. And I did already pull Blue Merlin. So the Merlin we get for free, the guaranteed one, basically be a guaranteed coin. So yeah, I really enjoy this banner. I know it's not that good. But uh, it's free summons, you can't really complain, right? So, there we go, it looks like there's gonna be a dead multi. Yeah, probably trash. That's okay though. We'll use this free multi to get all the garbage out of the way. And then in our paid multi, we'll actually pull some fire. In theory. Okay, let's skip this one. Yep, there we go. Alright, so a lot of AP pots right there. A lot of stamina pots. That's cool. And let's pop over to the actual banner now. I think we're going to do at least one full round here. Um, at least get the guaranteed if I get shafted all the way. And uh, hopefully pull a DN, man. Oh, by the way, I'm sure a lot of you guys have noticed this. But if you click on the DN, she does her little animation there. You get a pretty nice little show. I mean, <laughs> I'll leave it at that. I'll leave it at that. I'm not going to say how many times I've done this. Let's just say a few. Okay, first multi, 30 crystals, or gems, or diamonds. I get the names all mixed up, man. Every single game has a different currency, right? So, first multi. Not looking so good. There we go. All right, yo, tradition continues, man. Tradition on this channel is always a first multi, always dead multi, always shaft multi. That's okay. I'm gonna skip that one, because, yeah. Wow, that's a lot of gold coins, actually. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. That is a lot of gold coins. I'm actually trying to 6-6 six, six my Arthur right now, so I might buy an Arthur dupe. I'll think about it. Alright, so first multi is nothing. That's okay, though. That's okay, though. Second multi, we got Hawk. I was hoping for some stars. No stars there. We got the red text, but that doesn't, that, that doesn't really mean anything. As you can see, yeah, this is the shaft. Oh, wow. Uh, Alright. All right, you know what this is? This is Net Marble's way of taking back the compensation gems that they gave out 
for the Valenti banner mistake. All right, because <laughs> I didn't really want to talk about this. I didn't really want to admit this on camera, but I went two full rounds into Valenti's banner, and I don't know exactly how that happened because I originally was just going to do the first two steps, right? The 30 and then the, the one gem one, so two multis for 31 gems, and I would have been done, right? So that's why I didn't make a video because I was like, look, man, I'm only doing two multis. It's not worth making a video for, but then... I got nothing for the first two multis. I was like, I'll do one more because we can get three SSR pendants. There we go. Finally. Finally an SSR. So I did that. And then uh, I got shafted again. Did another multi, shafted again. Just like no no SSRs whatsoever. Then I did the guaranteed. I got a freaking Elaine. So I just kept rage summoning, man. Like the, it just got to me. Like the fact that like my luck was so bad. I was like, yo, there's no way I'm gonna leave this banner without something useful, right? And Elaine definitely wasn't it. So <laughs> um, long story short, man. Long story short, after a series of many shafts, I ended up spending two full rounds. And in the end, it kind of worked out because I did get 60 gems back for the mistake. But uh, there goes the 60 gems, man. <laughs> that that right there was my 60 gem compensation. The two dead multis. <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying, net marble just taking back there, taking back the compensation stones. All right, there we go. Or gems, diamonds. You get the point. Currency. Okay, what is this guaranteed? Not guaranteed. What is this SSR? We got a couple of the ends, which leads me to, leads me to believe. That they're trying to tell me something. And if it's the DN, I might be done actually. If this is DN, I'm done. It's not. Alright, so that's a 4 6 Merlin, guys. 4 6 Merlin for our 4 6 Escanor. I'm really hoping that we make that a 5 6 or a 6 6 Escanor today. I have a couple friends that have 6 6 Escanors now, courtesy of this banner. So, uh, it'd be nice to join that club. Or at least 5-6. At least 5-6. Alright, Simon. I don't think there's any other gold crystals in this multi, so I think we might as well just skip it, right? Yeah, there we go. Alright. So, Toop, Merlin, no surprises. And that was our third multi. Fourth multi here. It looks like we're gonna have to spend at least 210 today. Uh, that 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 looks dead to me. That looks dead to me. Although you never know, because we didn't get crushed yet. So there's always a chance. There's always hope. Rainbow, come on! Ah, uh, gold. All right, all right. We're not dead yet, though. We're not dead yet, though. I still have hope. Losing most of the hope. Ah, all right, let's skip that. I, I doubt it's gonna be a fake out. Yep, yep. Could have been a fake out. Didn't feel it though. So I think skipping was the, the right decision there. All right. Got another Hawk there. We got Red Golemize. Red Golemize, a lot of times does lead to an SSR, but it's not guaranteed. Like a lot of these animations really confuse me, man. Sometimes I get Red Golemize, like most of the time, actually. I, I would say like 60% of the time. 70% of the time. Red Golem Eyes, the Flashing Eyes, we get an SSR. And then, you know, the other times this happens. And also the red text too, when like the skip is red. Like, what does that mean? What does that mean? I literally get like... Shafted most of the time when I get red text, <laughs> I feel like. Alright. Trash. Okay, so we're up to 80% now, right? Up to 80% now. We just need one more shaft for the guaranteed SSR. Uh, and I think this is going to be that shaft right there. Oh, never mind. Never mind. All right, so we're getting another SSR here. Hopefully, it's the end. Hopefully, I can just call it a day. Uh, although, I probably can't call it a day because we'll be so close to the SSR that I have to keep going to get the SSR. <sighs> First world problems, man. First world problems. <laughs> Complaining about getting an SSR instead of getting shafted so that I have to keep summoning. Alright, here we go. 
So hopefully the next multi is a shaft, so we can get a guaranteed SSR in the one after that, right? That would be ideal. Alright, what's what is this one? Escanor, please. Escanor, please. Or the Anne. I'll take the Anne or Escanor. Here's the thing, like I, I have every summonable like new SSR that has come out since the game released. With the exception of Green Lilia. Oh my god, this dude. Um, I wish it was Red Gother. I wish it was Red Gother. I wish he was he could be like featured on these banners. But uh it's blue. I mean look, the funny thing is I actually got crushed by a team with a blue Gother, so I don't think he's that bad. But he's not nearly as good as the red one, obviously. Um What was I saying again? I forgot. Completely lost my train of thought. Oh yeah, uh, I was saying, I, I basically pulled every new SSR that has come out in the game with the exception of Green Lilia. And that was because I was boycotting the banner because I was like, this is stupid, it's a stupid banner. So, I didn't summon on that. But otherwise, I do have like everybody else. And I would like to continue that trend. I would like to still have a complete box. Oh my god, we're getting another SSR? So he still can't get the guaranteed. What this means is I'm gonna have to spend a lot more gems than I thought I would originally spend. You know, like I, I, I came in being like, oh, I'll spend 180, I'll get five dead multis in a row, get the guaranteed, and be on my way. But that didn't happen. Wow, that is a lot. Yo, we got we got a potential for like a couple of fake outs here. Cause we know there's at least one. Right, there's at least one SSR here. We got so many gold crystals, we could get like two, maybe three. It's happened before. It's happened before. I've had two fake outs in one multi before. There's the first. There we go. Wait, yes, okay. For a second I was like, is that, is that the right one? Or is that a different DN? But this is the right one. This is the right one. Alright, so yeah, she does sever damage with her first card. Second card is a pretty insane tank, uh, tank move actually. She what? She taunts and gets 200% extra defense or de defense related stats for three turns. It's wild. That's actually crazy. I'm I'm kind of interested to test her out actually. Would she would she be good in PvP in mean, like any way? You guys let me know in the comments down below, man. I think like she could be kind of annoying to some teams but probably not super effective overall hmm we'll see we'll see all right let's keep it going we got a bunch more of these sr crystals here could be a couple of more ssrs maybe or at least one more i doubt it nah i doubt it i do get quite a few, few fake outs though this is not just like me randomly you know, pulling at straws. Like, we get a lot of fake outs on this channel. Alright, there's a girl Jillian. There's Arthur. And that's it. You know what? Not not the worst multi. Not the worst multi by any means. Alright, I gotta keep going because we're so close to the guaranteed. I gotta at least you know, finish it out. Can't leave it at 80%. Okay, yeah, this looks like... Oh my god. Why won't they let me just get shafted, man? <laughs> alright, alright. What's this? What's this one? What's this one? Escanor, please. Escanor, please. Double. Ah, uh, okay. Just one. That's okay. No fake out. That's cool. Alright, Escanor. Escanor. Let's go. 5-6. 5-6 Escanor, on the way. I'm calling it right now. I'm calling it right now. It's gonna happen. If I just put that energy out there, put that that vibe out there, Escanor will come, man. He'll, he'll appear. Trust me, guys. It works. It works. It's gonna happen. How did I do that? <laughs> How did I do that? Yo, I was saying it, 
right? But I didn't even believe it. Like, let's be honest. I didn't believe it. I was just saying stuff, man. That's crazy. I literally willed Escanor to appear. Like, I was calling out to him. And this dude legit, like, responded to my call. <laughs> I love it, man. I love it. Yo. So we got the new Deanne. And we got the other, you know, SSR that I was really excited to pull. Which is Escanor. So he's 5-6 now, guys. 5 out of 6 Escanor. We're still going to keep going. Because apparently the game just won't stop giving me SSRs. Red Golemize. Pac. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. I don't, I don't know how to feel about this one, honestly. It's pretty um, ambiguous. Wow. Alright, here we go. 6-6 six, six, Escanor on the way. 6-6 six, six, Escanor on the way. This SSR is an Escanor. I'm calling it. I, I, yo, call me. Call me the Escanor Whisperer. Call me the Escanor Whisperer. Alright. Um, it's like the Dog Whisperer, except, you know, I call for I call Escanors. I speak to the Escanors, and they appear. Ah, uh, <laughs> didn't work again. <laughs> I mean, it worked the first time. Might as well give it another shot. Might as well give it another shot. But, uh... Yeah, I, I, th I think our luck is up. Although, man, like I, I gotta get that guaranteed. Like, what, what is, what is this? What is this? I've never had a situation where like I really wanted to get get a dead multi, and I just can't. I just, I just can't. All right, we got two more chances, right? Like, if we, if we get an SSR here, red golem eyes again. Okay. We did get pretty garbage multi. Yes, there we go. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I can finally be done with this banner after this. All right, here's the guaranteed. Red golem eyes, from what I can tell, means nothing. I mean, this time it means something. But we know we know this guaranteed here. I was, I was really hoping for the Escanor animation, actually. Because with these guaranteed multis, you always want to get like two, right? You don't want to get just the guaranteed. You want to get the guaranteed plus an extra one. But it's okay, man. We've, we've had some pretty good luck on this banner, honestly. Like, I don't, I, I can't really complain. Just one. That's cool. Always the potential for a fake out, as always. Unlikely, but possible. All right, give me that Escanor, though. Give me that 6-6 six, six Escanor right now. 6-6 six, six Escanor right now. I still believe in my Escanor whispering powers. Maybe there was just a delay. There was a cooldown, right? We used it in one multi. It needed to cool down. And now it's back. Now it's back. Let's go. Come on. <laughs> Game, just, just, just do it. Just do it. Uh, if I pull a dupe Deanne, what do I do with her? Do I do I use her as a dupe or do I just use her as a coin? Hmm. Some 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 hard hitting questions here. Oh, okay. All right, Green King, I'll take. I'll take Green King. That's my first dupe. I I just got him on. Actually, I just got him on the free ticket banner, the the blue Mer Merlin banner. And now we have a dupe. I'm probably going to feed this one in because uh, he's a monster. How do, how, why can't I click on him? We oh, can't click on things. I don't know you couldn't click on characters in the summoning screen. That's weird. All right. All right. So overall, guys, we did pretty well, right? We did pretty well. I mean, I had to spend almost all my gems, 330 gems. Which is much deeper than I thought I would have to go, but we just kept pulling SSR after SSR after SSR, and uh, it's not really a bad thing, I guess. <laughs> it's not really a bad thing. All right, so quick look here. We got Deanne. All we're missing now is Lilia, 
and also for some reason this red bond like I, I just can't pull this red bond uh, hopefully he becomes available in the coin shop sometime soon I'll just buy him like I just want to complete my collection and I think I'll get green Lilia on the blue Lilia banner so it's not a big deal um, but yeah man only missing two SSRs pretty 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 decent pretty decent decent and let's actually feed this dude bin to our boy Escanor here level 5 alt on the way I was already destroying everybody now even more so even more so 1176 percent attack what is what is the combined 1344 yeah we're gonna have some fun we're gonna have some fun with him okay there you go guys that is today's video thank you so much for watching uh what does that do for my team cc here all right 65k um 164 425 all right you know not bad could be better but not bad okay so there you go guys that is today's video thank you so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed it as always if you liked the video then make sure to like the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel and you like what you see then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the tiger squad now and while you're at it hit that notification bell too so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content let me know in the comments down below how you guys did on your summons on the green dn banner if you did summon at all or if you didn't summon then what are you saving for is it blue lilia is it red derriere is it uh red escanor possibly who is probably a while away but definitely still worth saving for right so that is today's video guys thank you for watching i appreciate you as always um oh until next time i completely forgot what i say at the end of videos until next time have an awesome awesome day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out